Hello, my fellow comrades. This video is going to be on the first appearance of Harley Quinn. Now, a lot of people will tell you if they if you ask them what comic did Harley Quinn make her first appearance in, they would say this comic. Uh, Batgirl Adventures, uh, sorry, Batman Adventures number. Uh, I'll put it over here again. Uh, and this comic uh, does feature Harley Quinn, and it's um, her first. Um, but the question is, is it truly her first appearance? Now, there is uh, another comic that might actually be her first appearance. So this comic is from 19, December 1993. Now, there's a comic that came out a few months before this uh, that is a little strange and a little bit questionable whether it's truly a comic. Um, and I'm going to show it to you right now. So uh, this is the one that's kind of seen, like even the label will say first appearance of Harley Quinn. So <laughs> um, the other one is one of those ones where it's kind of questionable uh, whether or not it's her first appearance. And that would be this one. Batman almost got him. Now this is one of those comics. It is a comic, and you know you can see it uh, uh, that was done uh, with like an audio tape. So normally you'd buy it, and it would have like an audio tape up here. It'd be like in a little plastic thing, and little kids would read, would watch it. Okay, you know they'd listen to it and read the book, and um, you know it was that kind of story. Now I'm going to open up my copy. I'm going to show it to you, and I'm going to show you why. This came out like before the Batman Adventure 12. And um, I'm going to open it up a bit. I'm going to read you a story. <laughs> um, it doesn't say the date, but yes, it does mention that it was printed in uh, 1993. I'm not sure if you can see that. Let's see if it will focus. But um, it does, it's like, you know, it looks like a standard comic and you can see there's Harley Quinn right there. Oh, she's like fairly prominent throughout the comic. I'm reading it backwards, but uh, she's featured on several pages of the comic. You can see her here. And she's throughout the comic and she's, you know, talking and in, she's part of the story. Um, so the point is, this is kind of her first appearance <laughs> as a comic. It's, you know, it's a very rare, <laughs> like this is extremely rare to find um, comic. Mine's in a kind of mid-grade, uh, but um, just a really rare uh, first appearance of Harley Quinn. I think it came out a couple months before uh, the, the Batman Adventures. So... As I said, it's just one that you might want to take a look for. Now, the way I got my copy, and this is a trick that you can maybe do, <laughs> um, is because it's kind of like a, one of those comic slash books, you know, it's kind of in that kind of genre where, you know, it's it was sold, as I said, with cassette tape and everything. Um, a lot of bookstores actually have it because they don't treat it as a true comic. And I got it, my copy from a book company online. And um, you, can, you can maybe even get it off of Amazon or some other book sellers. So you just got to do some searching. Uh, the, the company that I bought my from, they, I think they knew what it was to a certain extent because the pricing was fairly high. I, I paid $100 for this. But I've seen pricing up to several hundred dollars. So... Um, First, even a low grade like this, like a mid grade, I should say. So just so you know, uh, it's it's kind of a cool one. It's not recognized as Harley Quinn's first appearance, but it's definitely one that you should maybe take a look for, and maybe you can find it. Um, and if you can find it with the tape, oh my goodness, you're at, you can get some big money from Harley Quinn collectors. Very popular character. So hey, you never know. <laughs> so I hope. Good luck on the hunt, and I hope you can find it. Thanks for watching.